Sometimes, the only thing harder than launching a rocket to space is figuring out where it landed back on Earth. Unlike the giant rocket boosters that launch spacecraft and astronauts, sounding rockets usually don't spend more than 20 minutes or so in space. They deploy short-lived sensors to take readings of Earth and the atmosphere. But NASA can have a hard time keeping track of them when they come back. Obviously, we have telemetry systems and GPS systems that can track it and get us get us in the, in the neighborhood. But eventually, they go over the horizon, and there's a, a level of uncertainty. Their tracking systems can only narrow the search grid down so far. Then, helicopters try to locate the rockets. NASA even offers finder fees for anyone who stumbles onto one. Finding just one sounding rocket can fetch up to $5,000. But one NASA engineer thinks he found a better way. Scott Hesch is testing a way to track rockets that use seismic and sound data. He calls his concept TRIGS, or Triangulation of Rocket Impacts Using Ground Sensors. The idea came during a launch in Norway, when part of a rocket went missing. A nearby university offered to look through data from its infrasound sensors, which measure very low-frequency sound waves traveling through the atmosphere. It worked. They were able to triangulate the rocket's flight path. With that success, Hesch wanted to test the idea at a launch range in Alaska. He teamed up with researchers from the University of California, San Diego, including Frank Vernon, a geophysicist who directs the U.S. Array Network Facility. His team had already established an array of sensors in Alaska near the range. I was a little bit um, skeptical because of the station spacing being as far apart as we are. I was wondering whether there would be big enough signals to actually observe. Sure enough, the sensors heard the impacts of the rocket landings, and the data narrowed the search grids by half. Hesh and his team have had some success, but he doesn't expect the concept to become standard practice for several years. So, if you come across a sounding rocket, you still have time to cash in on that $5,000 reward.